Hi, I'm Phil. Welcome to Highly Habitus. This year I'm sporadically vlogging on the topic of supernatural hospitality, about openness uh, of heart to one another, of, of friendship and rich community, and how important that is um, to the life of the church and to the, the vitality of the mission of God uh, as expressed through us. And uh, there's this lovely passage in John 15 which, uh, in which Jesus says this, This is my commandment, love one another. In the same way that I have loved you, there is no greater love than to lay down one's life for one's friends. You are my friends if you do what I command. I no longer call you slaves, because a master doesn't confide in his slaves. Now you are my friends, since I have told you everything the Father told me. You didn't choose me, I chose you, and I appointed you to go and bear lasting fruit, so that the Father will give you whatever you ask for using my name. This is my command, love each other. I love that. Love each other. That's... So simple yet so difficult, um, but that's what Jesus says, love each other, don't tolerate each other, don't um, put up with each other, don't be vaguely entertained by one another or occasionally spend time in the same room as one another, love one another. Be friends with one another as I have become a friend of you. You know, there's wonderful truth that we are invited by the mystery of the gospel into friendship with God. Um, and as we do so, we are we are given brothers and sisters, we're given a family in God, we're given friends, uh, a community of friends whom we can connect with and, and whom we can love and who will love us. And that's one of the, the great um, and powerful and potent things about the church is that it's a community of friends of whom Jesus is the, is the chief friend, and, but we're all friends with one another. And friendship is so important, isn't it? And sometimes we can become so fixated on our task as Christians that we forget that community is actually one of the fruits uh, and one of the end results of, of the task of building the kingdom of God, that it's a, a reconciled community and we are called to be friends with one another. And I, I recognise sometimes and have seen this in myself that sometimes I, I neglect my friends, I neglect my friendship, I'm so busy doing that I don't kind of allot time, enough time, just to being with people, um, uh, with time, uh, without agenda for others. And uh, so my challenge to you, as it is to myself, is this week, is just to connect with a friend, is to spend time loving somebody, listening to somebody, um, maybe ring an old friend, maybe invite a friend round for a meal, but show hospitality, genuine hospitality, to somebody that you love this week.